So we're at the Day of Champions ahead of the Silverstone Grand Prix. And riders for help have put on a charity auction. Um, and Jorge Lorenzo is one of the riders who's just gone on stage now to auction off some memorabilia, some team merchandise. Now, while the bidding starts for that memorabilia, let's have a look back at what the other riders brought. Against a beautifully sunny day in Northamptonshire, the Riders for Health auction took place in the fans area of the Silverstone circuit, and the official MotoGP charity raised hundreds of thousands of pounds with the help of the World Championships riders. Colin Edwards raised £2,225, with the majority of that coming from his Tectoire leathers, which raised £1,600 alone. Hiroshi Aoyama's helmet raised £750 towards a total of £1,125 for the Japanese rider, while the Suzuki team raised £4,000 in total, with items including a weekend team package, Alvaro Bautista's leathers and Loris Caparossi's gloves. Danny Pedrosa auctioned off a pair of boots and signed visors, raising £600, while Alicia Spargro sold one Pramac t-shirt for £70 before the crowd forced the shirt off the Catalan's back with the extra visual incentive seeing the second shirt go for £300. So we're just backstage now um, with Aleish, who's just come off stage. Now Aleish, that wasn't the shirt that you were wearing when you went on stage. What, what, what? That's not the shirt that you were no. wearing when you went on the stage. <laughs> no, they, they won the shirt and, uh, you know, Riders for Hell, it's important. Uh, I give, we, we have uh, good money for the shirt and this is important. They literally took the shirt off your back, but you got quite a good uh, reception from, I think, the girls in the crowd when you took that shirt off. Yes, yes, it's important to have more fans and more fans, so I will, I will give shirts in, in all circuits. <laughs> but a very important day, isn't it? Yes, yes, it's, it's important to, to help uh, the foundation to do everything we can, we can to help uh, Riders for Hell. And, you know, uh, we always uh, give... Uh, clothes or glo gloves or boots or what, what, what they need. Now let's have a look at, so at how some of the other riders got on. <laughs> Nikki Hayden raised £1,850 with a painting and two T-shirt watches, while Mika Callio raised £300 with a signed T-shirt and a pair of boots. Pramac also donated two fairings to be auctioned on the Riders for Health website. So Following his crash in Mugello, Fiat Yamaha's Valentino Rossi was unable to attend the auction, but did make a very special phone call to the MotoGP fans. Later, Rossi's team raised £8,050 for the charity, with pieces such as a map from his motorhome, as well as a genuine helmet from the 2010 season, which raised £5,000 alone. Jorge Lorenzo, as we've just seen, auctioned off a helmet and other items to raise £3,055 and delighted the crowd by giving away T-shirts and caps at the end. With the donations from other riders and teams and the other Day of Champions events, Riders for Health raised nearly 200,000 euros. Do you want to see a commentary box? We have a tour of Valentino So some great stuff being auctioned away there. Uh, Jorge, I think you raised a fair bit of money. You did drop your helmet, though. Como? You raised a, a lot of money, but I think you dropped your helmet. Yeah, yeah, I... I... It uh, goes to the to the ground and uh, it hurts a little bit, but anyway, the people is fantastic, uh, paying a lot of money for for my pieces, and I'm so happy to to help uh, this uh, this thing. It's a very important cause, isn't it? Yeah, it's very important. No, you know, we are a fortunate people, but there is people in the world who are uh, who don't have money, don't have uh, medication or or they don't have houses, so it's, it's important to, to put a little bit of our money to, to these people. Okay, so that was another great event from Riders for Health. Uh, thanks for everyone who took part and uh, we'll see you again next year.